playing Warframe. Today we're going to take a look at farming a new uh, Prime Warframe. This one's called Baruch Prime. Baruch Prime was released in uh, de December 2022. Let's take a look at the relics that we require. Axie B5. You can see the Axie B5 is available here on Terrorum in Deimos. It's one of my favourite locations to farm. Also Hydron on Sedna. It's also a great location. Now you can farm on Uvarium if you want to also farm the Varuna at the same time. It's kind of cool. Or you could farm it on Tyana Pass if you want to farm the Citrine at the same time as well. Let's take a look at Lith B1. This relic you can farm from Terra Mondamos as well. Or Hif on Deimos. Neo A8 Relic. This one also available on Terrorum on Deimos. So that's a great spot to farm all of these relics. You can also get it on Uko in the Void. Which is great because it's a speedrun mission. Capture. Uh, you can get it from Hydron on Sedna. And also Uvarium if you also find it farming Varuna. And Tayana Pass if you're also farming Citrine. So that's pretty convenient. Lastly, we've got the Miso R5 relic. This one you can farm on If on Deimos, Uko in the Void. Also, um, Io and Jupiter. Io and Jupiter is good because it's uh, rotation A, so stick around for one wave and that's it. 14% chance to drop. Many other locations as well, but they're my favourites, so let's go and give it a go. You can see I'm using uh, Vault for uh, speedrunning. I'm going to go and hit uh, Uko and the Void. Because this mission is very, very fast. You can do it in one to one and a half minutes. And bring them to the extraction point. Happy hunting. And Uko gives you a 6.7% chance to get the relic drop, which is not too high, but you can run these missions very fast. Excellent work. We'll interrogate the captive back at base. Your part is done here, Tenno. We're done. So 1 minute 20. So I got the Miso R5 drop that time. Rook Prime Systems. So the next location I want to go to is uh, Hydron on Sedna. This is a good mission because um, you get plenty of people farming this mission, so it's good for grouping. And I'm using the Cora Prime so I can use in Strangle Dome, which is great for defense.
Now on Hydron, the Neo A8 Relic has a 10% chance to drop on rotation A. That's after 5 or 10 waves. And you can also get the uh, Axie B5 Relic here as well, which is dropping on rotation C for an 11% chance to drop. Oh, there's a Varuna here, that's kind of cool. And a Styanex. I'm still busy collecting focus because I've been uh, changing up my focus schools. Okay, one more wave for rotation A. Okay. Do you choose to leave now? A Neo M4. Not what I was looking for. Another opportunity to extract will appear soon. And up to the end of uh, wave 10, which is another A rotation. A ribbon sliver. That's nice. Uh huh. Neo A8. That's one of the Baruch Prime relics that we need. Sorry guys, I'm going to keep going up to rotation C. <laughs> Even though everybody else was leaving. I want to try for the um, Axie B5 as well. Nope. Got Axie T10. It's not what I wanted. That's okay. So I did get the Neo A8, which is a Brook Prime chassis. Okay, I'm going to swap over to Varuna now. Pop in an Oricon reactor. 
Going to mud it up a little bit. Use up all my points. If you want to see my video on how to farm the Varuna, I'll Did put a link in the description hungry? below. Did they anger you in some way? Okay, let's go. I'm going to go back to Deimos, Terror Room. Terror Room has a 11% chance to drop Lith B10 on Rotation A. 12.5% chance to drop the Neo A8 on Rotation B and a 11% chance to drop the Axie B5 on Rotation C so it's a good location for those three relics Get ready for a capsule. my Syndicate attacking me or the rival Syndicate kind of annoying A oh, ribbon sliver. I've delivered another life support capsule. Of course, if you're collecting syndicate points, you can um, buy the relic packs from the syndicates as well, which will help you along with the rook prime. We've got a wave rider here too. You really? Into the end of second rotation, eh? Okay, looks like we're heading out. Wait for the 10 minute mark to pass by. The longer you fight, the more successful we will be. Well executed. And we got ourselves two Lith B10 relics. Rook Prime Blueprint. Alright, let's try another one. Back to Terra Mondemos.
Life support incoming. Okay, I've skipped forward to the rotation C, which will be ending at the 20 minute mark. Using the fangs of Rakish. Okay, I'm going to head towards the exit now. Got about one minute left to go. Okay, 10 seconds left. The longer you fight, the more successful. Oh, we got the Axie B5. Another job well executed. Very cool. And that is the end of this episode, guys. I hope you liked it. Click like and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye for now.